What a week it was. Actually, it's been last two to three weeks. We've been having some nice badass results. So welcome to another video. And this weekend's video is going to be really beneficial for you. I'm going to show you how we made money and how we can make money just by following some very simple rules. Not a rocket science. I'm going to show you some of my live trades from my real account so that you know in trading it is not impossible to make money if you have your rules or strategy there. So before I continue, two announcements to make. Number one, I have just launched a new channel but only for the people who speak Urdu. So it's Money Markers Urdu. If you're someone from Pakistan, Bangladesh or India or from the country where you speak or understand Urdu, then I've just launched a channel. The link is in the description. I'll be uploading analysis in Urdu and I'll be also uploading lots of educational videos for you that will help you to learn trading in more depth and of course it, it will be in your own language you can able to understand it in more efficient manner so i'll start uploading video there from next week make sure subscribe number two i'll be doing live session next week tuesday or wednesday i'll post a link a day before on my telegram channel so make sure keep an eye so that we can do some live interaction do some live trading and live analysis as well so it's going to be fun and also i'll be making a video how to read natural gas financial news because i've got lots of messages and so many traders got confused when they saw the inventory report so i'm going to make a separate video how to read inventory reports accurately and that's going to be next week as well then we have Priority group, as you can see, the trade results right here. All these trades were sent in the priority group. And remember, these are just a trade that was just one to one risk to reward ratio trades, not more than that, because I personally go more than one to one. But for the beginners, I always recommend one to one. And also, if you are my student in MMTA full course, it is not all the strategies which you are learning. These are some few strategies which I teach you here on my YouTube and to my priority members if you are a core student then there are a lot more other strategies a lot more other entries which we had throughout the year and your gains will be much more higher if you combine all those strategies but here's something that was sent to my priority members as a trade alert and as you can see so far the gains are 70 percent right here the whole year results so far since january to april till date right here and as you can see the natural gas was a winner none of the trade were a losing trade every single trade i sent in the priority group was a winning trade right here so far and i don't say that it's going to be same next month i don't know what's going to happen next month we might have a losing streak as well but so far every single trade i sent in the group was a winner right here we have one trade in january and then second in january two trades in january then we have one in february and then we had one in march actually two in march all of them were a winning trade now if you are someone who joined priority group right here that we had a losing streak then it will not reflect a bigger picture because we have these type of streak lots of time last year we had four to five six losing trade and then who knows what comes next and as you can see we had a streak of winning trades right here and these are the results that will give you reward in long term but if you're someone who say the priority group is a magic group where you can become rich it is not something you just join for one month you see a losing streak and then you say okay i'll cancel my subscription because it is not for me you just had your losing streak but you don't know what's going to happen next if you're under your risk capital if you have not blown up your record in these three trades and you have not done any sort of revenge trading then you won't be able to even get through these trades because after these three losing trades we had a streak of winning trade that is why very important to stay under your risk capital and never go for revenge trading and also the time of the trades depends on a close of the candlestick pattern sometimes i send trade a little bit late sometimes i get a better entry for example this AUD JPY trade that was the entry candle was right here if you are my student in MMTA course you know that this is an entry candle exactly right here but I managed to enter right here to the at the next candle and that hit my take profit if you would have entered here at the close of the entry candle then it wouldn't have hit your take profit but luckily I got chance to enter a little bit below and that hit my take profit so that's why the time time can be different when I enter if you have entered a bit early or late that might show difference in the time but that is according to the entry candle when it's 
closed. Four hour candles when it closed. So starting with the educational part of the video. Now trading should be simple. And that is how I teach my members. That is how I teach my students. I don't want you guys to have lots of complicated lines, lots of levels of support and resistance, lots of indicator. Then it doesn't look like a chart. It just look like a snake game. I don't want you guys to have so many indicators. A very simple rule, have your support and resistance there, have your two indicators there just to look at the trend, have your ATR to see your targets and RSI to see overbought and oversold situation because I've seen people that are trading with so many indicators that you won't even see candles and it's just hidden behind those indicators. That is why it should be simple. When the price hit your level of support, you go, go for buy trades, a counter trend trade. When the price hits your level of resistance, you go for a sell trade, a counter trend sell trade. In between that, what we are looking at? In between that, we are just looking at pullback entries below 50 EMA, sell trades above 50 EMA, buy trades. So very simple and very easy. So let's look at the Euro USD chart first now this zone support was sent to my members on 1st of april last week now if you go back right here this zone has been mentioned from last two weeks as you can see this it was mentioned in my last report as well and euro usd zone was sent to my members right here an area from where we were looking for possible buy trades on smaller time frame right we were already prepared to take our entries and what do we have after that we did not enter blindly we entered with conditions right here. A zone report was sent to my members and after that I've sent a trade alert to my members as well that we got a signal that we've been waiting for and now we have an entry condition and what was my entry condition a nice bullish engulfing pattern if you follow me here you know this is my entry condition and nicely hit 1.421 targets now if your risk tolerance is one standard lot right here if you go to my website moneymarkers.uk just scroll down and see profit calculator right here if you have placed one standard lot with using 1.421 you would have just made 704 dollars just with a single trade and this is something we entered with conditions with patience we did not enter anywhere like i said in the start of the video what we do before the price hit my zones we only go for pullback trades right here a bearish pullback trade which is right there which i took and then we have a bullish counter trade because the price hit my area of value and this was a trade i took on my real account my ic market account is connected already and if you look here that was my sell entry with this arrow i exit my trade right here that was my buy entry and right here exit my trade on my own platform on ic market because i do all my analysis on oanda i have tested every single thing all my back testing has been done on oanda and i also have an account with oanda that's why i sometimes take trades with my other brokers but using exact same strategy and exact same condition i see on oanda so you see how nicely we entered and then we exit at 1.4 to 1 take profit initially it was sent one to one to my members like i said for beginners i recommend one to one and then once you are profitable you can also manage it till 1.421 or you can also manage it till the recent areas which is right here to the level of next resistance totally up to you next we have commodities a zone report sent to my members on 24th of march in the previous commodity zones report not the last one but one before that and as you can see a zone for silver was sent to the members right here and this was an area we were looking for a possible buy trade right here as you can see how nicely the price first fall from the level of resistance that has been mentioned in the previous report right here and then we were looking for a level of support right here that was mentioned in my last report which is a bullish trend continuation zone right here price nicely pushed down and then formed a nice double bottom pattern bullish engulfer how nicely it blasted up from here so that is how very simple what we looked at a bearish trade from the level of resistance then a bullish trade from the level that has been recently broken with the conditions only we did not enter without condition because remember i've said that i will be looking for a possible double top from this area again and we had no condition so we did not enter because we had no condition we have no selling signal why the hell we would enter the trade so conditions and signals are very important right here we had a sell bearish engulfer we had a buy bullish engulfer from the area of value and that is how the trading should be simple and easy without confusing yourself.
And right here, just to show you the Euro USD trade I've just recently shown you, which is right here that has been entered in the spreadsheet. The trade we took right here. Then we took another trade, which is USD CHF. Now, for this one, I was waiting for the price to hit my level of resistance and then go for sell trade. It did not hit. The trade alert was sent to the members for a buy trade, not a sell trade. Why is that? Because the price did not make it to my level. Instead, it just pulled back down and we had a nice bullish engulfing entry reason. There we entered our trade and as you can see, it nicely hit my take profit and then it quickly pushed back down. So that is why very important to have your stop loss and take profit both. So always wait for the condition as price did not make it to my level. I did not get fearful. I did not get into a form of fear of missing out the, that the price start to push lower from here. We are getting the signals from here. No, I'm very strict with my rules. I will only enter my sell trade if I see a valid condition from here. A very good example of a trade which is right here. USD Japanese Yen that trade took me two weeks to hit my take profit and here the patient paid off and as you can see I've entered right here with at this pin bar a double top pattern that could be an entry as well which is right here if you're my student you know these entries this is where i've entered and as you can see multiple times the price pushed down pushed up pushed down pushed up again gone above near to my stop loss pushed back down and then pushed back up and then finally and eventually it hit my take profit and that is how the trading should be if you have entered your trade don't exit your trade until it to stop loss or take profit right here i placed my trade on ic markets which is right here my exit candle as you can see this little arrow my live account is connected and that is how we make money with patience with conditions and following the rules and rules are very simple when when you are in the counter trading zone you take your sell trades or buy a trade when you are in between the zone you go for a pullback entry and sometimes the zones doesn't even play out and ex an example of that is right here a zone was sent to my members i was looking for a possible sell trade even though we had a weak signal which is right here that that trade wouldn't have been played out and hit your stop loss right here so not every trade can be a winner you have a losing as well you have a winners as well but as long as you're under your risk capital then you know in long term you will still come out as a profitable trader and a good example i've just shown you i'll show you this example every single day every single week so that it it will give you a confidence to take the trading seriously you can see the results which are right in front of you the gains are 70 percent if your risk tolerance is three percent then you can see the result gone up to the gains gone up to 5k if your risk tolerance is five percent it's totally up to you your gain has gone up to ten thousand in just four months and 101 percent would be your gains if your risk tolerance is five percent i personally go two percent that is according to my account balance and everything is with patience with condition now again if you are my student in mmta right here a premium plan is something that will give you full knowledge you don't even need to wait for my signals you will learn the other strategies there as well that will give you a better roi and when the entry happens you just quickly enter your trade with that standard plan is free for one whole year and this plan is enough to give you full knowledge in order to become independent profitable trader if not it's totally cool make sure you hit the subscribe button and like this video so that you get these education content every single day then we have gbp usd right here the zone report sent to my members on 25th right here and we were looking at this zone to take our next possible buy trade we were prepared we are not gambling there we know that this is a zone from where we can get a possible reaction out of the buyers and as you can see a nice push up i've entered on one hour time frame because we had a nice double bottom pattern and no, this was not a trade alert sent to the members but i took it personally right here a nice 1.4 to 1 target has been hit that could have gone up more than one to one it's totally up to you if you want to manage if you want to manage it till the recent highs like i said this is the place where you can manage your trade still but a nicely pushed up from here zones sent to my members as well aud japanese gen exactly the same we are we were looking at the zone for the possible bounce out of and as you can see the price pushed down from bullish engulfer and that hit your take profit and it even pushed up massively from the zones i've sent to the members right here and the push up from here was around 200 pips so that is how we enter our trade very simple and easy as you can see if we are trading below 50 ema we are looking for a, a trending trade a trending sell trades only until when until we are in the zone before we go for a counter trend trade a trade alert sent to the members as well right here for gbp usd right here as you can see we entered here and that was 
trend continuation trade which was a bearish trade until when until we hit the zone once we hit the zone right here we took a buy trade now if you wanted to manage as you can see how nicely you could have managed it till the zone from where we were prepared to for the next entry condition right here this trade was also recorded in the spreadsheet gbpusd that was sent to my members but this was a trade i personally took but again no excuses the zone was sent to you if you are looking at the zone seriously without using the group as a signal group if you're learning from it then these are the trades and possible trading opportunities we had throughout the weeks and how nicely we could have made money with these zones Lastly, I want to show you one indices, one index, UK 100 index, which is right here. A zone was sent to my members and I've been sending these zones to members from last couple of weeks. And as you can see, once the price hit my bearish zone, I was looking for the trade on a smaller time frame. And what do we have right here when the price hit my zone? A nice bearish engulfing pattern. How nicely it hit my take profit. And that is enough for you to make money out of indices for these types of moves and we were prepared for the entries and as you can see the price also formed a double top afterwards and right here with this bearish 382 candle if you're my student that is that is another entry and how nicely it pushed out of double top pattern as well aggressive entry played out double top played out if you know the rules why the hell you can't make money in the financial market just following some simple rules so you see how nicely forex commodities indices every single instrument out there has been reacting nicely but one thing is common your zones are common you need to know how to mark the zones you need to look at the conditions once there is conditions you are good to go long once you have a condition you are good to go short if there is a rejection twice you know there is a double top these are the rules you need to master once you master your rules trust me trading can become your full time business i hope that gave you some confidence and hope you have learned something out of today's video and if you're learning something make sure to back test Test your strategies 100 times at least for one single instrument once you're confident once your strategies are profitable only then jump into the real market and start trading and keep your risk lower so that you won't get fearful and you don't exit your trades early so with that being said let's start our analysis with natural gas gold silver and crude oil natural gas was pain in the ass when the price was just ranging like this i know lots of you got scared when the price was pushing up and down but if you follow me from last couple of years or if you follow me from last couple of months i was bullish for natural gas throughout last whole month i have not said once that we are bearish for natural gas except short term just for a short term we had one, one entry right here a short term bearish entry if you are my student you know this entry and that is what i've said i've always said that we are bullish long term and i'm only looking at this area for my possible double bottom entries on four hour and even on daily time frame we are getting a possible double bottom entry right here and we are getting a divergence in the rsi and a strong signal on a weekly as well and i've kept saying that in the long term we are bullish for natural gas and i'm still looking at the price to hit my level above in red and even in my last video i've said that i'm still bullish for natural gas long term and short term we can look for a possible sell trade that is what i keep on saying and i got lots of messages that we're going to go down to zero price is going to crash from here but not a single time i got scared because i trust my analysis everything which i talk in my youtube videos has been tested rigorously that is why i never doubt on my analysis so let's see where i've been saying from last few videos and if you see here we're also getting a divergence in the rsi but divergence alone doesn't mean that it will push up with divergence i want to see a complete hit of double bottom at the upper level or on a daily time frame i want to see a double bottom here with the conditions of double bottom i've just mentioned if we have that we have a divergence in the rsi and that will be a very strong signal as long as we are above this previous high we are not in any sort of downtrend we are still pushing up and i'm still expecting a price to push up from here if we are broken below with momentum in that case i will go for a little scalp of sell trade short term awesome so I've been mentioning that from last couple of videos that we are getting a condition and if we have a zone hit which is my double bottom pattern that will be a very very strong signal and, and that has exactly happened what we've been expecting from the price to do. Price nicely pushed up hit my take profit if you, if you see it the price pushed up massively 
2 to 7 risk to reward ratio has been hit now and i have exit my trade because it is not a trending market it is just a start of the trend i only manage my trades when i see a nice trending market for example we had a nice trending market from right here price is making new lower lows and in this type of scenarios if you want to manage it i keep on managing my trade to the next levels which is right here or right here because the price is just trending lower and here the price is just in a process of starting a new trend until we are broken above this high i will not manage my pullback trades for now i'm expecting a good bounce which we got and the way price action works as long as price is making lower lows we are pushing lower but until when until the price forms a condition at the area of value right here so the price reaches to the level of support a demand zone where it rejected and then it pushed up from here now that could be a start of a new trend from here we expected a price to push lower that has happened and at this point it formed a double bottom pattern now we had one rejection here we had one rejection here and the price pushed up now when will be a time when i start to look for my next sell trade for long term as you can see price is making new lower lows until the price makes another low which is from here i will not go for my sell trades because we are in the level of support and there is a likely chance that price is going to bounce from here which the price did and we did not break below this low so price gave us a signal that i want to push up from here with the rejection and it pushed up now the next signal i wanted to see a price to come back to the same level without a price to close below this previous low as you can see the price did not break below the previous low with the candles only wick has gone down and body did not close below so that was another signal a rejection followed by bullish and call for that was an entry we took in the priority group as well and that gave us a signal that price now wants to push up from here and there was a double bottom pattern as well on daily and on weekly and on four hour time frame as well so that is why i said that i'm still bullish for natural gas until we are not completely broken below this low we are not looking at the downside so as mentioned in my last video that this was a trend line i was looking at for my next condition and if broken below i want to see a pullback followed by bearish and golf and price will likely push lower so do you see any entries here no entries and that was just a fake out out of a price and then it pushed back up and there is no condition and we have no reason to enter over trades and we look for a condition a valid condition that is a bearish engulfing pattern below 50 ema so at this point we are again above 50 ema so i'm still bullish for natural gas as been as mentioned and i'm still looking at the area above for my next counter trend trade which is right here 1.895 that goes up to 2.011 so what i'm expecting from here i'm still expecting a price to push up from here let's see how it opens if it opens above that is a good signal if it opens below this previous low again i will start to look for my pullback entry bearish till when till the price come back to the same rejection area which is right there in number in blue from where we can get another spike up but let's see how it opens if it open as normal or above all i want to see a complete break above this high and then i start to look for a pullback entry bullish and keep on taking longs till we are in the zone above which i've just mentioned from where i will look for next sell trade with bearish and golfers double top inverted ambers 382 candles bearish so still not bearish for natural gas as long as we are above this previous lows we are above this level of support i'm just looking for buy trades and buy opportunities which i've just mentioned with a pullback and bullish engulfing pattern still bullish for natural gas i was still expecting a price to head higher from here but let's say if the price opens below if it opens below only then i will start to look for my pullback entry short term bearish entries below 50 ema if we have a valid condition till this area of value which i keep you guys informed so just look for buy trades as just mentioned here on capital.com as price just broken back above if we are broken above this previous highs in that case we have exception to look for a pullback entry bullish idly i want to see a pullback entry bullish once we are broken above this high but looking at the imbalance and broke below 50 ema then broke back above 50 ema we are allowed to go for a good momentum above 50 ema then a pullback if we have a bullish engulfer we can look for a buy condition but a week that will be a weak entry again if we are broken above this high and then a pullback that will be a very 
very strong pullback entry bullish till we are in the zone above in red which is right here a major area is 2.002 that goes to 2.1 Five three from where we're going to look for our counter sell trade if we get a condition. Nemex exactly the same. The zone above, which is right here, one point nine four seven, that goes up to two point zero nine five. From where we're going to look for a counter trend trade. Otherwise, if we are broken above, we are looking for pullback, pullback entry followed by bullish engulfers and keep on taking long. If you have broken below this low, in that case, I'll start to look for my pullback entry bearish only till we are back in the zone below in green, which is right here from where we can expect a possible push up again. But I will keep you informed once I see conditions. Next, we have silver nicely pushed up as mentioned in my last video that we are getting a possible pullback entry bullish. But let's say you have entered at the bullish engulfer above we're using 180 r which is 30 your stop loss would have been hit but if you are my student you know what type of entry we had right here that certainly hit your take profit easily another valid pullback entry and now price is pushing up as we have just made a new high we can still expect another good pullback and a good breather followed by bullish engulfing pattern and we're going to go long from here till when till we are in the zone above let's say if you have no breather and this price is pushed up straight away in that case we have a zone above 27.86 that goes to 27 28.57 from where we're going to look for our next sell trade with bearish engulfers double top entry pattern now i'm also looking at my fibonacci entries aggressive entry which is from the top of the scale till the zone below that has been recently broken 50 percent retracement if you're an aggressive trader can be a spy limit order and take profit can be 1.618 retracement 1 or 2 atr you can manage your targets up to i've said that if you're looking for a fibonacci entry which is right here stop loss is below take profit 1.618 retracement if you took fibonacci entry 50 percent was your buy limit order and that entry has played out nicely price did push down and then it massively pushed up and heading towards your take profit right here that has been played out nicely so a zone above is your selling zone from where i want to see bearish engulfers or double top entry pattern and i'm still expecting a price to head towards 1.618 retracement and the zone above in red then we have gold a valid pullback entry this was also valid and this is also a valid pullback entry right here i'm still looking for a valid pullback entry bullish we can still get a push down followed by bullish engulfing pattern if we have that we again good to go long only looking for buy trades we might see a good and deep pullback to 50 ema as well or above 50 ema if we have a condition like bullish engulfing candle in that case i'm going to go long so only long trades with a pullback something like this with conditions once we have a condition we are going to go long and that certainly hit your take profit easily so at this point expect another good breather likely till this little anchor level so expect a good breather till here and then expect another push up from here but i want to see a condition like bullish engulfing pattern exactly something like this and as long as price is giving me a signal i will keep on riding along with the trend and keep on looking for my pullback entry bullish let's say we have no signal and price dramatically fall that is also expected above 50 ema in that case i will still look for my pullback entry from 50 ema and keep on taking longs using one atr for my target it's so only looking for pullback entry you also look for your rsi entries if you are my student but i will go for little scalp for that so that's it i'm looking at for gold lastly we have crude oil crude oil has just formed a bearish engulfing pattern i'm expecting a good breather out of crude oil but and that is not a valid pullback entry bullish if you are my student you know one rule was not met here but I'm still expecting a price to give us some more breather above 20 EMA, possibly with a bullish engulfing pattern. If we have that, we keep on going long as long as price is making new higher highs. I'm expecting another push down and again a spike up from here. We can also get a good breather to 50 EMA from where we can get another push up. And all I want to see a push down followed by bullish engulfing candle for my entry still when till we are in the zone above, which is 90.71. That goes up to 93.26 from where we're going to enter our counter trend trade with bearish golf first double top entry pattern a very major area from where i'm expecting a very big push down so that's it for commodities guys that was a long video i hope you have made it till end and if you have you are a legend hit a like button for me that really helps me in a youtube algorithm and subscribe if you're new so that we can all trade together and trade efficiently hope you trade green the rest of the week see you guys in the next video have an awesome weekend take care